How's it going guys? Uh, ABC here with another A Pirate's Tale uh, tutorial video. Uh, this one is kind of for the new content that they just added, the freight system. Uh, it's a pretty cool update. It's definitely the best way to make money for a new player. Uh, as long as you follow pr these pretty simple steps, uh, I really recommend that if you guys are going to be doing this, you should really use a private server. Uh, you don't need to use one, you can also use a low pop server, but if you're a new player and you don't really have too much money, uh, you should definitely probably invest in a private server or have a friend that has one because if you lose your ship during this you will lose it forever because it's not a premium ship but yeah guys let's go ahead and get into how to actually do this new uh, freight update that they added so the first thing you're gonna want to do when you go into the game is you're going to want to go over here to the ship right and he actually sells the ship that you're going to be needing which is the freighter ship just a ship right here it's only 1500 gold not too uh, expensive and then once you buy that you could go ahead and head over to the general store and the thing you're going to want to buy at the general store is you will probably want to buy the cargo drop point map uh, that is going to cost you about a thousand gold I believe but you will need it because that map is going to show you where you need to go to sell the cargo so yeah, uh, after you get the cargo ship, you're just going to want to pull it out here. It's just the freighter. Let's go ahead and pull that out. Just spawn it here. Uh, this thing definitely is very uh, susceptible, or not susceptible, but it is definitely uh, an easy target for people that want to steal your cargo or that want to just kill you. So uh, I recommend that if you aren't going to be doing this on a public server, you should definitely, or I mean sorry, if you aren't going to be doing this on a private server, you should definitely bring a friend or two uh, with you uh, on a ship behind you, kind of close behind you, so that if anybody tries to attack you or steal your cargo, you can go ahead and just uh, bamboozle them so that they cannot take your cargo. Okay guys, so now we have this spawned up and we're going to go ahead and park it kind of right here along this dock here. Okay, and this is how this works. So you're going to want to go over to the pickup po uh, point and just click the little crates to pick it up here. And then uh, you could actually, if you see on these little square things, each of these can hold four. So your goal is to put four on each and, ev uh, each and every single one of them. Uh, in total, you should be able to have about 40 different... Uh, cargoes so I'm just gonna kind of speed this up a little bit for you guys and I'm gonna cut it to when we actually have 40 on the ship okay so we are done putting the cargo on all of this ship uh, kind of spots here we have four on each you guys can kind of see there's like four on every single little square adds up to be about 40 in total actually I kind of missed one right there here let's throw that on really quickly just cuz uh, you get a lot of money from each of these these are definitely worth doing so just make sure you have uh, at least 40 on your ship. Okay, so now we have the entire ship full of cargo. And now what you're going to have to do is you're going to want to press I. And then you're going to want to equip the cargo drop point map. And then once you do that, you're just going to want to uh, select it with 5. And then press M. Or not 5, but whatever one that your uh, map is, whatever hotbar your map is on. And then you're just going to want to press M and look where you need to go. So for us, we need to go and head over to this little red X right here. Uh, it, I think it might be the same for everybody. It might be different for Cave. But all you really need to do is look on your map after you buy the, uh, the cargo drop point map. And then look for the red X. And then you're just going to want to head over to it. So yeah, uh, you sh like I said, you sh might want to use a private server for doing this. Just because... Uh, if you use a public server, you're more than likely going to die. I mean, you should be fine as long as you do it on a server nobody knows you on or you do it on a low pop server. But once someone decides to come after you, you are probably screwed because this thing has little to no protection whatsoever. But yeah, we're just going to go ahead and head over to that red dot here. Press our little map here. There we go. And I'm just going to kind of chop it up to you guys so that you will see when I arrive there. Alright, so we are at the red uh, X location, and the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to look for this kind of green cargo-like uh, pointer. Just drive straight up to it. Uh, you're going to want to get somewhat close. Make sure you're not too close so your ship doesn't break like that. 
just close enough like that and now you're just gonna want to come over here and just simply click on your cargo and then sell it and as you guys can see I kind of have like 366694 after I sell it I have like 366851 so it's kind of you make around I think 150 gold per and then I have like 11 or 114,508 now I have 114,821 so it's over 300 XP per crate and about 150 uh, gold per crate so you can multiply that by 40 and if you guys think about it like that's like 40 times uh, 300 that's like 12,000 XP that you get just from one run on this thing and then 150 times 40 which is like uh, 50 like 60k or not 60k like 6k which is also really good so yeah guys that's pretty much it you just keep selling and then once you're done selling all your cargo make sure you click them all individually because there is 40 of them if you put the maximum amount on uh, you're just gonna want to drive your ship straight back to the port or cave wherever you are or you could just reset as well that's probably the easier option just reset and spawn back at your spawn island and then just do it again so this is probably the best way at the moment to make XP and money and it is pretty uh, pretty self-explanatory hopefully I get Gave you guys a couple tips for this but until next video i'm abc pwned and i will see you guys later